The cutback in water meant a cutback in production at Coca-Cola bottling. But now with the lifting of water allocations, company officials say things go better with more water. I'm very elated that we have got to a point that we can do this. And I think that uh, if everybody continues to conserve water as we have, we'll be okay in the future. Bottling at the plant dropped by about 40% during the water restrictions. Now the plan is to slowly build back up to full production. With similar increases throughout Norfolk, the city is expecting water use to go up once again, possibly by 10 million gallons a day. But even that projection is well below the figures from a year ago. City officials hope it will stay that way. I think it's uh, human nature that it w will increase some. We uh, predicting hopefully that only uh, approximately a 10 million gallon a day increased eventually. I don't think the consumption will jump up that far initially. The big factor is the lawn watering. If people will cooperate with us, we can hold the consumption down. There are some concerns now that the penalties are off, that water customers will go back to their old habits. But city officials say they'll slap the penalties down once again if water usage goes way up. In Norfolk, Chris Cahoon, The Daily News.